Before we even get to this video, please like and comment to help push this video. It took me a week to finish this. We almost about cried like 12 times doing this video. So please, please, I love y'all. This, 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 this is the life, 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 this is the life. Huh, ain't nothing like hip hop music. This is the life, this is the life, this is the life, this is the life. Hey, it's me, Tali. Y'all probably wondering, who is she? Well, she is me, and me is Stevie J side chick. I met Stevie J through my brother Scrappy, and honestly, he was just supposed to manage me, but we got a little bit intense. I've been comfortable with just being a side chick, so whatever he got going on with Mimi and Jocelyn, it doesn't bother me. It do. It bothers me real bad, but he pays me to keep quiet, so. So you think you can just walk into my house like that? Cause I got something for you. It better be that Annabelle doll that I told you to get me. I am before it blows up. When I heard on the radio saying she was single, I was like, oh, hold up. Tonight's topic is about falling in love or having a relationship with somebody that you work with. Hmm? Who? How do you work the business out with the pleasure, with the relationship? First of all, I am single, but if I was in a position to work with a lover, it would benefit me in a lot of different ways. Hold that thought. We're gonna pay some bills. It's getting a little hot up here. Um, you know, give us a call. Sleeves off, you're out there, holler. Stevie knows about this? Yo, me and Stevie already made an agreement about what we got going on. So shut the fuck up and stop snitching on us. I don't know. All I know is that, listen, when you came around, he put all his work into you, he put all his effort into you. So that shows me that he was really into you. Listen, no neck. I told you, I'm single and I'm sticking beside what I'm saying. I'm not trying to get into the mess with his baby mama and Jocelyn. I guess that's what they say, huh? Man, look at the way that fits, that thing. This is not the gift that I wanted. I wanted Annabelle, the doll. We had a misunderstanding the other day, and I figured the best way to resolve it is just to make you smile. Well, that didn't work. I'm blank faced right now. Anyway, why are you telling Benzino that we together? What do you mean? What you mean what I mean? Don't be acting dumb. I just want you to know, you know, my door is always open for you. Well, you need to close that door because I'm not trying to be in your little triangle. I'm only here for your money, and that's it. Understand this, right? I care about you. I want to make sure we're on the same page. I thought we were, but now you're trying to be messy boots. You guys probably wondering, do Jocelyn and Mimi know about me? Hell no. He told them that he was managing his cousin. Cousin. <laughs> Apparently, these slow asses didn't catch on yet. We're going to continue on this journey. We're going to continue getting this money. And you're going to continue being happy. And that's it. Thank you. But we can do all of that silently. You really need to change how you live in. What needs to change is my baby's attitude. And that don't take much at all. I can honestly say that life is great. Hello. Hello. I know what you're all thinking. This ain't that. Last night, I went to pick up Eva from Stevie's house. A few minutes later, Jocelyn storms in. Jocelyn's gonna get put in her place. But she has to remember. There's a line that we draw that can never get crossed. Stevie told me that he was having issues with the tramps. Me being the great cousin that I am, I decided to go with him to approach Jocelyn. He was getting out of line in front of my daughter. Oh, please. Oh, no, no, Oh, no. please. So, who lived there for three months? You. <coughs> <coughs> Why you allow your baby mama come upstairs while I'm supposed to be staying up for the past three months? I want to know, too. She was tired. I took... Stevie, please. Honey, this is too much. I made you the princess, baby. This is too much. Baby. I've been a princess without you. She thirsty, she hungry, and she needs you. I don't. Goodbye. I'm out with the girls, K. Michelle and my brother's fiance, Erica. I don't really care for her, but since K. Money invited me out, I figured, why not go? I do have a good announcement, a big one. Okay, what's the tea? I got a brand new record deal with Warner Brothers. Woo -woo! You know what I went through yeah. with, with all of that. So, but somebody say, I believe in you. To me, 
I'm cool with that. Not only do you have some good news, we have a future bride in the making. Oh, you gonna put it in my face like that? <laughs> <laughs> you deserve it, sis. Like when a man get it right, it's a great thing. I feel like I should throw you like an engagement party. I'm gonna have the people you love at the party. Who are gonna be at this party? You know, Mimi. Yeah, that's the party. Mimi, Erin. Erin admitted to having with one of my exes, but she never told me that. She, she violated the G code. So have y'all talked? No. She look, I don't, don't want to talk to her. Can she be there for me? If I don't have a problem with Mimi being there for Erica, you should have a problem with Arian being there for her too. Yeah, for you, definitely. When Erica invited me and Arian to an engagement party. I was really excited for her. Who's gonna be there? I know Kate put this together, so. Kate Michelle and I aren't on speaking terms right now. It's because I just admitted to a situation that I was in with Kate Michelle's ex. Are you serious? So how are things with you and Stevie? So I'm at the house temporarily until I get my place. Temporarily my ex. I was like, what the f Like, what? Okay, you okay? <laughs> What's been going on with you? You had him and you didn't tell me? He's you should have told me from the beginning. Regular. I forgave you once and it won't be a twice because the okay. once was, the <laughs> once was, I won't hurt you again. Done. Y'all with each other. Yes. I don't know if it's just me, but why do everybody look like Jocelyn, but just in different fonts? Arian and Erica look just like her ass. Stop! Wait a minute. If you like this little shirt, just listen here for a second. Y'all, check out our Tolman Boutique Infinity Legs for your fashion needs. Also, we don't discriminate towards short women. Just click our Not Tall, We Got You Sis tab and see for yourself. Don't forget to check the description box below for any promo codes, anything like that. And now let's get back into the tea. Give me a kiss. At one point, I went definitely hard for Scrappy. So when Scrappy proposed to Erica, I was so shocked and confused. He never told me not one time, not one time he was dealing with Erica at all. It's obvious that Erica was the side piece and he just fell in love. Just move on with your life. For him and Erica are not a good combination. I trusted everything he told me and everything was a lie. I know my brother ain't <laughs> And Shay know my brother ain't <laughs> Why is she begging to be back with my brother? This man got a whole fiance and he got a baby on top of that. At this point, Shay's being desperate. If you don't hop on some other D-I-C-K and leave my brother alone. I lost a part of me, but it's cool. I'll get over it. Never give up on you. Mama, stop making this girl delusional. Shay, just give up. But I'm not finna fight for nobody that don't want to be kept. Change isn't coming. Ever since Stevie kicked Jocelyn out of the house, the three of us have been spending more time together. Green works. What does that mean? Green, green works. And you believe that money fixes everything it does not. Is that the door? Yeah, that's the door. You got the heater on here? It's hot in the door. Yeah. What's up? As you guys know, I'm Stevie's cousin. So I told Jocelyn to come pick me up and take me to his house. But the reason why I'm there is because I want to pick up my check. Hey, May. I see you got on your May I feel like you always do. Let's go, let's go do my... I'ma show you I can take your man again if I wanted to. Molly the maid. Taking your man again. I'm so sorry, Mimi. My cousin really ain't shit. You gotta be nice, Mimi. He went back on everything he said. Defending me, defending his daughter. You wanna call me a maid and you not gonna say It was a joke. She made a joke. Maid? You gonna say is joking? She said swingy. I'm gonna need to bite your ass. You need to get. <laughs> she should have started biting like a wild animal. You know, at the last night foolishness, my man came back to me. I'm his peacemaker. What's up? Last night was great. Why you got an attitude? I got an attitude because I'm getting tired of all this nonsense. Me getting in between your family and then your other side piece is draining me. Huh? How my ass. I just want you to help me with my career, and that's it. I'm already sabotaging it by being a homewrecker. And that's not a name that I want for myself. 
11 months ago, we laid in this same bed right here. And I told you I was going to do for you. And I've done everything I told you I was going to do. And we've been doing everything. I'm just not about to be a little puppet. Jocelyn can, but not me. Because honestly, I really don't need you. If you want to run around and do it by yourself, just going to have a small career. This small. Well, can you put all that energy into my career and make it this big? So, so you saying just don't do everything I got going on. Just focus on you. Damn right. Drop Jocelyn from your management and focus on me. You playing with me. I'm about to just start looking for work myself. Let you know this. I want you to run around. But just remember one thing. Everything comes back to the gatekeeper. I just want to get back to work. And it starts by me getting this contract from Stevie. So where's my contract? Do you have that together? I'm not giving it to you. You should have it. If you keep this contract away from me to feel like you own me. Do I own you? Yes. And you can't tell nobody you own them. Well, lately you ain't been giving me my 30%. Well, lately I haven't seen my contract. Mama and I decided to go to the studio to see Scrap. But not only did she bring me, she brought his little old friend as well. If you feel I'm treating or judging Erica too prematurely, I apologize. Every girl you ever dated, always like call me mama. Mama making a good point. You your own man, but all I can do is a mother to warn you. You know, that's what on you. Warning? What warning? To leave Jocelyn looking like a long dumbass. You're your mother's son. Oh my gosh, I'm not here for the drama. But then again, I am. Yeah, I'm a hypocrite because I love the dramas. I love the drama. Alrighty, big bro. We about to head out. I just don't see how we've been friends for so long and that's where we started. The only reason I did make that move is because I wanted to be with Erica. And if I could do it over again, I I mean, I would make sure I had that conversation. As long as you happy, that's all that matters. You know that I want it. It's been a crazy year for Carly Rae. Uh oh. <laughs> what you doing in that booth, girl? Sounding horrible. Am I bugging out? What? I haven't seen Rashida in a minute, so I called her down so she could hear this disc record against Kate Michelle. You wasting it? songs on me? Look, I'm gonna waste one on you. Come on, get on the verse, girl. You better off asking me, not Mrs. Put them on the make them want to marry me. Mm -hmm. You know what? Think to about be honest it. with you, I think about it. Kate Michelle feels like she needs to constantly talk about me on the blogs all the time. But I've been the bigger person. Yeah. Celebrating my independence. I invited the girls over to have drinks, mimosas. What brought on the change, the sudden move? I'm, I'm lost. Well, I was staying at Stevie's temporarily. I was trying to find a house. The process was taking too long. She is lying. She wanted to get back with Stevie, but she found out that he was still messing with Jocelyn. You mighty quiet. Girl, I'm just taking it in the air. You all right? Rashida, you okay? Well, why wouldn't I be? Come on now, one of y'all gotta say how y'all feel. You know, I think I come across your mind a few times here and there. Who takes no time to type a fool? The same person. Person. Just, okay, just be worried like about when your gonna your hit the floor that fake oh. when that mother oh. drop and your oh. in the hospital some oh. way, okay? Ooh. 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 <laughs> Kirk and his three earrings, I said, hello. Kirk and his three earrings? What do lovely TV saying? This tea is what? Hype and hot. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm okay. Rashida. I rap like Shorty Love. Bitch, you know what? I'm done. I'm so angry at Steven because it's like, I asked you for my contract. You don't have it. How much money made? Seven thousand. I just come in here to get the bread. What's going on? my bread because you book nothing. She booked this show. Act like a manager, and then maybe your will get paid. What you need to do? Find my mother contract. And tonight we're gonna sit down and have a little dinner. And I just see a lot of negativity. You know what I'm saying? Coming. If you love Erica the way you say you do, and Erica loves you the way she says she do, then it get married. I've seen the other women. I've seen the chief. She never told you the positive stuff. Scrap, what else could be positive? Because what she says sounds horrible. And if that ring is the only positive thing, that ain't shit. As your oh, mother, like, let me say look this. How, look how many times your mother's disrespected me. Your mama, on the other hand, is always disrespectful and calling me a If my mama calls you a she calls you anything Wait that's a minute, your no. name. At the end of the day, don't call my, my wife me no Understood. You no. just call him a five or ten minutes ago. No, I said, if my mom. Oh, what you know about to do is yell at my mom. It's a bad lie. I know sometimes my mom could be in the wrong, but at the end of the day, that's my mama, and I'ma stick beside her. You just walk in right back now because I know who you are. I've had 
had years of disrespect from Mama D. What you mean what I mean? What you mean what I mean? Don't be acting dumb. Hi, my ass. I just want you to help me my little the mirror. I'm Rashida. <laughs> I'm like shoddy love. <laughs> she was hilarious when she said that. Well, where's my necklace? There we go. I got some type of accessories going on. Almost trip. Damn right. Job drop. Damn right. Drop drops. I cannot talk. I hope she cheated on you with a basketball player. You need to get. <laughs> Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced.